channel um as you guys know or should know if you follow my videos if you haven't please make sure you stay up to date and watch my previous videos but your girl has moved ding 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 ding, ding down into her own apartment which is super exciting um i love everything home decor lifestyle fashion related so of course stay tuned for more home decor updates and things like that regarding the apartment but with every time you move well of course you know when you move you need to get new things and you want to like judge your style a little bit um so i decided to go to I did a little damage, not nothing crazy. I think in total this was like $215, but it was like stuff that I like I needed um, or I know that I needed. So I'm going to take you through all the things that I got. Sorry about my hair too. It's just like I washed it and I let it air dry. Excuse me. And you know, this is how I went to the store. I just came back and let's get into this haul. So the first thing that I got is um, my the bathroom that I have here is kind of big as far as floor space. So I didn't want to get the traditional like two bath mats. I just thought that wouldn't look right. So I got this nice charcoal fluffy ooh, <laughs> bath mat for the bathroom. And I think this should cover most of the floor. Um, and of course, like when you get off the shower because you don't want it to be like wet. This was, how much was this? $19.99, a little pricey for a bath mat, but I think it's definitely worth it um, because of the size. So, got this puppy. She wrapped this up nicely. Oh, so, you know that, um, of course, cozy season is just about here. Summer is unfortunately over. Had a great summer, but of course we love, or I love, fall. And every time I think of fall, I always think of like blankets and movie night and candles and things like that. So I stocked up on some candles. Now I do suggest if you do shop at Marshalls or uh, TJ Maxx a lot, in their candle section, the best, okay, listen to me. The best candle brand to get from TJ Maxx and or Marshalls would be by DW Home. Look at this. This brand right here. You have to get this specific brand because it just makes, no matter how big or small the candle, it just makes your home smell so good. Like, so good. So, oh! I wish you guys could smell this. This is um, Island Mango, juicy, sweet, and fruity, just like me. So, <laughs> it's tantalizing sun-blushed mango, sugared guava, and juicy papaya blend with citrus-splashed melon. Ooh, make me think I'm going to the islands. Hey, this one smells delicious, so I got that. Another DW Home candles. All the candles that you'll see in this haul is from DW. Like that is the specific candle brand that I look for. I'm not buying another candle brand because I know this makes the house smell like paradise. It smells so good. So this one is the Patchouli Oud. Um, and this one was $7.99. This one actually was on clearance for $4. I'm gonna check at the actual DW Home website because they do have one for this specific um, scent because this just smells so good, so good. Um, and this one reminds me of like a man, you know what I'm saying? Like, baby, this one smells really good and also like that it has a wooden wick in here. So um, wooden wicks basically give you that um, like fire crackling sound like you're at a fireplace. <laughs> or um, it just makes it like super homey and I just like to hear that crackling sound. So I got this one. This one was $7.99. Then for my plant babies, I had to get some new planters. So I got this specific one. It's black with an ombre white, so cute. This one was 
Um, the planters by hand here I also got for Marshall. So I got this one. Woo! Hold up. <laughs> this one's pretty big. Um, this one was $19.99, but I needed this for like my bigger um, plants because they need to be repotted so they can flourish and my children can develop into these successful, amazing plants that they will become. Um, and then this one, love the detail on this. Oh, so pretty. I got this one for $16.99. Now this one didn't have a price, but Homegirl at the register was like nice. And uh, she was like, I'll just give it to you for $16.99. I was like, thank you. Thank you. And then I got this one for $9.99. Like this is a pretty decent size for $9.99, which is really great. Um, I will say again, if you're looking for planters, make sure you stop by Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Do not go to Home Depot or Lowe's. Their planters are like overpriced. Like that large white planter I just showed you, that will easily go for like $40 at Home Depot or Lowe's. And I'm always on a budget and why would I just why would I do that to my 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 pockets right for the shower I got this little shower caddy thing um I don't know if you guys can tell but the vibe that I'm trying to go for is like more like sophisticated black and white modern boho pops of greenery um and things like that so I want it to be kind of like cohesive throughout the house um and still be very like gender neutral i don't like it to be like super girly or super femme or like super masculine but i just want it to look nice and cozy and welcoming like welcome to my home <laughs> anyway i like this brand umbra they have some really good like home decor items and pieces in general for that specific brand but what i liked about this shower caddy is i don't know if you can tell from the side but like you can pull it like, you know how you have like, like those really fat bottles <laughs> and sometimes they don't fit in a typical shower caddy? This one, it, it will fit, it will hold you. Or it, sorry. And it has like these little knobs on each of the sides to hold like your washcloth or your exfoliating gloves or whatever you want it to hold. So, I got this. Then, then! <laughs> Ooh, she tied this pretty tight. Oh. Actually, this is not mine. This is my grandmother's. Oop! Got some mittens because we're gonna be chefing it up and baking, so I need these to protect my little hands. This was $5.99. The shower caddy was $12.99. Put that there. Then, now, I do not like your typical drying stations i guess that's what you would call for um your dishes so i don't like those plastic drying stations i just think they're just an eyesore and they're super ugly so what i got was this can you see it's a dish rack with a drying mat so this is exactly what i want i'm gonna put this away when i'm not utilizing it like i just think that takes up so much space on a counter and it's just not appealing um, and then I got the dry mat as well with it. And this was a steal. This was $6.99, guys. Like, what? What? Bargain princess! <laughs> so, yeah, I got this, which I love. Like, sp cleaning sponges. These are called the Practical Matter for Tough Everyday Cleaning Jobs. Um, so, yeah, just some sponges to do the dishes and kitchen cleanup. Those. Um, I got this room fragrance spray. Boop. This is in the scent Tangy Citrus. Let's smell this. I think my mom actually picked this out for me because, wow, the top just came off. Let's see. Ooh, smells good. So this will be for the bathroom, of course. Um, you gotta do your business, you know, handle it. No judge zone here. I got this. Of course, if you clean your bathroom, you know what this is. This is a toilet brush holder. But I just like how sleek and like sophisticated and just like modern it looks. You know, it's not your typical plastic one. Uh, this one was, how much was this? $9.99. Of course, I know I could have gotten it for like $3 or something. But 
for ten dollars it's not that bad like and it just looks cute sitting in the corner you know this cute rug for the kitchen when you're um doing dishes and things like that it's super soft i love it um and i just love like the prints that it has some um, hand towels now, I don't know if I'm gonna put these in the bathroom or I'm gonna keep them in the kitchen because normally I need like a hand towel for when I'm like, I buy the stoves and you know, when you just wanna wipe up messes and things like that. So I might keep these in the kitchen, but gray. And, you know, boring stuff now. <laughs> and like essentials that you'll need for your apartment. So I got a um, scrub brush, which you'll need, still wool. For some pans you know i also got this which is a sponge holder this is not a necessity um however i don't like clutter i don't like things like really on the eye so when i'm obviously done with like a sponge or something i'm just gonna plop it in this bad boy keep everything nice neat and organized i'm going to have to get more of these but i got some velvet hangers I'm probably gonna have to get like two more packs of these, but they only had the 25 pack and this was the last like black hanger one. So I'll see if I can order some more off of Amazon. But this is a great deal. Like another thing that you should always get from Marshalls is their velvet hangers because it just makes sense. The price is right, it's a baby. So I got 25 black velvet hangers <laughs> for $9.99. Wow! I got this look at this look how cute this is so pretty so I got this little duster because of course as you guys can see um I have a fireplace in the living room and just like to dust them things down and just to make it dust free right so I got this to do that and it's so cute it looks like how oh, was that called that cat called a Persian cat a Persian cat's tail. We got another DW home candle. Honestly, like, I'm gonna speak this to, into existence when I do get a following on YouTube, on this channel. This will be a dream, a dream sponsorship, a dream company to work with because their candles are just so good. Like, so good. Um, and like you see how tiny this is this will light up the entire room. It's just so fragrant so good I got this in the eucalyptus sage earthy and relaxing and I'm thinking this might be like more like a bedroom candle or bathroom candle You know what I'm saying because sometimes certain candles and certain scents should go in certain parts of your home You know guys, right, thank you for tuning into my Marshall's haul though again, there will be so many like home um decor of vlogs hauls videos things like that i'm just so excited to decorate because i love decorating and i'll take you along the way i'm going to be repainting the kitchen cabinets doing different hardware updating the towel in the bathroom um you know judging the living room a bit i don't have that much to do for the living room and the bedroom but it's it's going to be a great ride right i hope you guys stay tuned and you know Hang out with me because I'll be nice. Please, thank you. And yeah, I'll catch you on the next time. Bye!